So, can you remove pen and sharpie ink from trading cards? I've seen it time and time again when you've had a rare trading card like this last always here from base set, and then you turn it around and boom, you've got some ink on it. So, can you get it off? Well, that's what we're going to try and find out. We're going to be trying out seven different methods today that I've found online through forums and things like that to test out to see which one's the best. Our first one is water just to kind of be like our control. WD-40, mainly used, you know, as a fix-all, but also can remove stains and things like that from oils and that kind of stuff. So I've got this fat nozzle, look at that. We've got screen wipes, which contain potassium soap, which is used to get rid of stains from clothes. IPA, also known as isopropyl alcohol, also known as rubbing alcohol. It's a solvent used to dissolve most compounds, and more importantly, it dissolves without a trace. Lemon juice are all natural choice. Low pH due to being high in citric acid, definitely can dissolve more than just your teeth. Acetone, also known as nail polish remover. Powerful solvent was one of its key jobs being to remove ink and marker pen, but will it also remove the ink from the card? And then liquid chalk. Bit of a wild card, contains magnesium carbonate, but the main thing we're interested in is the fact that it's alcohol based. So first up, water. So yeah, water basically didn't even scratch the surface for it. Over to WD-40. Oh god. Ugh. Hard to apply. So WD-40 did okay with the marker pen, but did exceptionally well with the ballpoint. WD-40 gets everywhere, so it did coat the card. Um, is that good for your card? Probably not. Screen wipe. Screen wipes didn't touch the marker pen and took very minimal off of the ballpoint pen. Next up, IPA. Well, that's pretty instant. Jeez. So IPA has done exceptionally well, uh, but has left a mark on the card. So although you can't see barely any of the marker pen, there is definitely like a stain mark there. Ballpoint pen, again, a lot of it's gone. There is a little bit of ink smudging around the place, but we still have that almost like a shadow cast. Overall though, it's done pretty well. Lemon. Where's my knife? Oh, lemon scented stabby stabby. Took very little off um, on both accounts, hardly noticeable. So we're pointing out if you are gonna do any of this at home, be really careful. It, some of this stuff hurts. I would say don't try this at home, but kind of point of this video is you might want to. <laughs> So acetone, didn't get rid of all of it, it's also left a little bit of a shadow there too. But not awful on the marker pen. On the ballpoint pen it did a lot better, but again you can see that shadow and also there is definitely some ink smudging going on. I'm not so sure that's the ballpoint because the ballpoint was black and that's blue ink. So I think it's smudging the card ink. Last one, liquid chalk. So liquid chalk has taken some off, but has also taken some of the card ink off behind it and damaged the card, as you can see. Also, it's hella messy. Look at that. Uh, ballpoint, similar story. It's taken the pen out, but it's also taken the ink off the back of the card too. So yeah, here we go. I ran from best to worst. So this is obviously my opinion. Liquid chalk was worst because it's actually damaged the card without taking away the stains. Water second because it did nothing and nothing's better than damage. Screen wipes third, because although it didn't take anything away from the marker pen, it did take a little bit away from the ballpoint. Next up it's lemon, oops, because lemon took a tiny bit off of the marker pen and a tiny bit off of the ballpoint. Rather surprising, WD-40. So it took a fair amount off of the marker pen, as you can see, um, but when it comes to the ballpoint it absolutely excelled. Um, it took loads off, just a tiny bit of smudging, but not as much as others but you can still see a little bit. Second place goes to acetone. So it took a lot away, but it's left a bit of a shadow uh, and also didn't take it all away. And then with the ballpoint, it took pretty much it all away, but it started to smudge the card ink a little bit. In first place for me, we've got IPA. So the IPA took all of the marker pen off, but did leave a shadow, but you can only see that in certain lights. When it comes to the ballpoint, similar story. So it took pretty much it all off, a little bit of smudge left there, but we got a shadow but still overall better than all the others. So there you have it, IPA. Just be really careful of it, don't drink it, don't put it in your eyes. Now where's that Blastoise?